Hey GTA fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zila, and we are here today doing Project Eden. Finally, I know, you know, like everyone else has done Project Eden. I don't know if anyone's done the snow starter yet, so um it was funny because I was going I was looking at the starters and this one says, you know, equipment none. Everyone else has equipment ex equipment none and it's a it's a snow planet. <laughs> um no tutorial, so I I think it should be insane. Okay, so I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna run with the default seed, whatever it started with there. I, I named it and then uh, I'll show you the settings. Uh, I'm just going to go with uh, medium player settings, medium life settings, and uh, a little bit modified here. Rich and plenty for the resources with auto miner set to deplete. Enemies, all their stats are hard. The constructors are set to fast, and the blueprint. Is set to fast. Um, the blueprint spawn limit, I'm going to set that at false until they actually have some sort of game mechanic that makes sense. Even even if it's just, you know, right now it's a, a, a pad. It could be a wood pad, a block of wood that you need to meet. <laughs> you know, it's, it. I don't know. If they enforce it with something like, you know, you need to have a constructor and Wi-Fi or something to bring in tier one and then maybe, you know, or, or like a small constructor, maybe a, a large constructor for tier two, uh, maybe uh, uh, like a repair bay or something for tier three and a tier two repair bay for, for tier four, you know, with all the uh, above, you know, so all the, the constructor requirements would also increase. So advanced constructor, I guess, for uh, the top two tier with the repair bays. Uh, I don't know. What do, you, what do you think? That would kind of make sense. But other than that, I'm going to run with these stats then. We're going to use CPU and uh, <laughs> mass volume. Uh, it sounds ridiculous, but we're going to try it. I don't know if we can get them the actual mats in this game. I think we can from vendors. I think I think we might get lucky and be able to purchase them from vendors because it is somewhat randomly generated. So I think he might draw on pool of like standard Polaris sort of um, traders. And if so, hopefully it's from a current pool that has the new uh, stock in it of, of parts. So let's go for this. So Snow Planet, crazy, crazy, crazy. I think that the – I don't even know what – like do we get any – we get no gear? That's crazy, right? We got to start – I guess I'll have to go into my suit as we're falling and, and take a look, see what we get. And If we don't have a survival con, uh, constructor – or not constructor, but a survival tool, we'll have to make one on the fly type thing. Uh, literally. Literally. Whew. Okay, so you can see this is a very large scenario because it's taking a long time to load. I have a very powerful rig, so something that takes a long time to load must be massive, absolutely massive. Uh, so we'll let the if if you have a potato, this might take ten minutes. I don't know, but we should be able to plow. My rig will plow through it here. It's chugging along, but that's okay. Okay. It's almost done. It's just loading all the structures. Come on. Come on. Throw us into the atmosphere. Oh, there we go. Structures. Throw us into the atmosphere. Maybe. Okay. Uh, head for the woods. Head for the woods. There's water over here. That's not bad. So we can see that border, and we can see that pole. So okay, so we can see both poles. So it's a tiny little planet, <laughs> and we're in the middle. So and okay, so it's a volcanic hot springs. I think we we aim for the woods, right? We try and build 
like a little a wood shelter immediately. We we gotta get these rocks and stuff on the ground. So maybe we uh maybe that's what we should aim for, the rocks. I don't see any uh oh yeah, that's silicone there. And copper, is that so oh oh critters. No, they're not bad critters. Okay, let's uh I think we'll Oh, I forgot to take a look to see what we're going to start with. Okay, I'm just going to pan out for a second. And let's go. Okay, so there's a signal somewhere. Um, okay, and it is 20. It's a balmy 22 degrees. So we're okay. We're okay. We can breathe. We're okay. We're okay. we got a survival tool. And we've got a bunch of hot beverages. Let's put these here. I think and we'll put our band-aids down here we don't necessarily need to eat right away so that's it we just got to find a signal well that's yikes we need to get shelter going I, I think we'll worry about the the signal some other day <laughs> right now we need to uh, collect enough resources level up to get a at least the at least at the bare minimum here we, can, we do need some rock we might as well grab it um at least at the bare minimum one of those uh heater coolers right but uh, ideally i don't think i i think by the look of it it's going to get super cold at night so let's let's head into the forest i think this is where we're going to get resources from we got to look for uh look for the colored rocks mainly and we'll pick everything we can see at a level obviously Okay, so it's 15 C. Already it's cold in here. Not good. Oh, oh, lost colony. See that? Ahead of us. So we do have a marker. Um, okay, I'm looking for food. I'm looking for rocks. I'm not worried about wood right now. And I'm, I am I am very worried about... Oh, there's a rock. There's some more rocks. Okay. And some, some of the flowers. These flowers you can turn into, uh, you pick them for buds, which you turn into hot beverage. Um, we'll take a look at the, there we go, level two. So I don't think we have enough to build the heater cooler yet, but I think that has to be our very first thing, right? Heater cooler. And we're going to do that. Uh, oh, you know what? I think that's like level two. No, level three, I should say, isn't it? Is that level? Let's take a look. Let's take a look. Uh, portable constructor. And, oh, yeah, heater. Okay, so let's unlock that. We're going to need that. So we got to level. We got to level before we freeze to death, right? Or we build a shelter. Okay, so that so now we've got to find, we've got to find a lot of resources. Uh, we, we need enough to make uh, the survival constructor. Let's just make that right now, then, because we can turn we can turn stone into ores if we need to, and there looks like to be a lot of stone. Obviously, we're going to be making a uh, a wood shelter, and what we're looking for right now is just rocks. We want to get as many of these rocks and level up. We need to hit level three. Ideally. Nice. Now, if critters come after us, we could have a real problem. Uh, that's where picking up this protein is going to help a lot. Because if we have to run, it's going to consume our food levels on us. And we'll have to eat constantly. So, if we don't have a lot of food on us, we could starve, and that could be bad. Also, uh, when you start freezing, you start losing your stamina. Lots of things when you get sick or you're injured, you start losing your stamina, which, which when it regens, which it naturally does, even if it's, even if it's getting consumed by something, it still naturally regens whatever per second, and that consumes your food to do it. So 
if something is sapping your your stamina, it is in a sense sapping. What was that noise? Or that just wow? That's kind of creepy. Uh, clear sky, and uh, I hope it doesn't go into radiation right away. So I'm just picking all these things just in case we need to uh, turn them into hot beverage. Looking for rocks, looking for rocks. We really need rocks. We need to level. Level three, come on. I might have to just start chopping down trees. Come on, colored rocks. Oh, there's one. And yeah, I'm not I'm not sprinting because I don't have a lot of food. I don't want my food getting consumed right now. It's really dangerous to do that. And we we're not in a big rush. I mean, we're not freezing to death yet, right? We're only barely below uh, recommended body temperature, and it's it's almost warm enough in here. It's just level we need level three pick all the things hopefully nothing comes after us looks like we might have a day's grace or something if he might have done that at least the uh you can put that into the into the um config i believe Oh wait, if it's a custom of config, I wouldn't have been running it. So, eh. Does that go into configure the YAML? I can't remember now. There we go, level three, level three. Okay, let's make this heater cooler now. So, yeah, let's pop that out. And we'll go into here and get that going. Okay. Heater cooler, nice. Okay, so what do we need? We need more copper, and we need more copper especially to make a core. Okay, so let's pick everything though. There's fiber, silicone, oh, there's copper. Once we get the heater cooler, we can venture out into the little bit colder areas too. stay warm but I have a feeling we're gonna we're running out of time so I just want to collect this stuff these rocks right here and start gathering wood I don't think uh, uh, I don't know if I'm gonna have sufficient copper we're gonna have to get rocks I think because we're, we're running out of time I guess I could run west let's start running west then let's start running west And uh, get some time because it's such a small planet we can we can like easily keep up with the Sun it's kind of funny um, just looking for stuff to pick rocks mainly rocks oh it's getting cold Need those rocks where's the rocks That's another reason why I'm in third person is so that I can see a little bit higher. You can it's a little easier in the grass here to, to spot stuff. And so I can actually head in that direction. Sometimes I'll just miss stuff entirely if I'm in first person. It's just it's harder. You don't have the peripheral vision and you don't have oh there's looks like copper. Nice. Nice. That's mainly what I need right now, I think. Because I need some ammunition too. Oh, I see more copper. Yeah, see, we're, kept, we're keeping ahead of the, uh, the sunlight. Yeah, nice, some more. Oh, excellent. Okay. Actually, I'm going to grab this really quick though. It's food. Okay, so actually, it's food. Let's we can grab that. Let's start making tons of 
make all that into stuff. Let's get this down on our bar here. Actually, here, let's swap that. I have a feeling the heater cooler is going to be used all the time here. I don't want to run into uh, nighttime. I want to have a shelter built before then because I'm pretty sure the heater cooler will not be able to keep us warm enough. So, got to get a shelter up and running. That's going to require a, some, a few solar panels, um, a capacitor, a core, a door. Um, yeah. Okay, come on, rocks. I need more rocks. I haven't even discovered any uh, deposits, have I? No. <laughs> That's a little scary. Okay. Well, we'll just keep heading west. If we want to get too north, it'll uh, start getting too cold there. Or warm again. Yeah, we might have to turn the middle of a forest into our base. Oh, I see some more iron up there. Okay, good. Okay. So there's water over there, but I mean, we're on a snow planet, so it doesn't really make a difference. It just if you place your water generators in water, you get like an 80% return. Whereas if you just place it on snow, I think you get 50% or lower or lower possibly. So, I mean, it is advantageous to put it in the water, but I, I don't know if I want to build out in the water. I think uh, I think we want to be in the forest. It seems to be warmer in the forest too, so yeah. Okay, let's just keep taking advantage of heading west through the forest. We're gaining gaining daylight here, and we'll keep collecting. What's our uh, 165 okay so we got we got lots of weight we can handle there's some more silicone good looks like more rocks that resource rocks over there too possibly but we'll grab all this So at least we're not going to starve or suffocate on this planet. That's not going to be the issue. It's going to be, it's a snow planet. So I'm expecting those arachnids to be in the forest here. Um, I'm actually surprised I haven't spotted any yet. Come on. But, okay, so we're running out of west forest. So we're going to have to run a little bit northwest. It's going to start getting colder. Hmm. Um, well, I'm also not really planning on making an extravagant base at all. Actually, not even anything past just a little wooden box, a little wooden crate. That's what we're going to start with. And really, that's about it because... Uh, I don't want to spend a lot of time on a base on this scenario. I'd rather try and run through the content that he's created. So, or he, she, who, they, where, uh, I'm not sure. Sorry. <laughs> don't know. Don't really know gender. It's, uh, I shouldn't be, be assuming it's a guy making a, uh, a scenario. There's lots of uh, non-guys that play the game, so. Okay, we're level four. Um, we are still heading west through the forest, so I'm kind of happy about that. But we are running in the mountain-ish 
area. I think we're going to have to hunker down here. What do we got for mats? We got 17 iron. That's it. But we got a decent amount of copper. We got some silicone. So we need some more crushed stone. And we need. So let's. Okay. So there's a bunch of rocks over here. Let's uh, let's grab them. And I know I could be doing a lot of this with a drone, doing the uh, crushing the stone up, and just kind of buzzing around, stand in one spot. We will do that over here probably to, to warm up with our heater cooler. And oh, there's uh, there's rocks up in there. I'm actually liking right here. This is nice and flat and kind of open. Yeah, I think this is this is where we're setting up. This is where we're setting up. Uh, I can go smash those rocks to clear their them out of the way. Let's put this down. So we've got it on us here. Uh, okay, I don't want to make it have it in the way. Let's just put it there. Put the stuff in it. And I think we can start getting that constructed. So let's yeah, get that going and we'll go we'll go uh, smash some rocks and cut down some trees. Probably faster if I made uh, biofuel, but we're only at three minutes here and counting. So time is of the essence. Uh, we'll grab this sort of stuff too, but I just don't want to deviate too far. Let's get rid of these rocks. We'll get rid of all of these trees if we can. Oh, not salvage. Defense. A chainsaw makes short work of of this stuff, but you know that's not a luxury right now. We'll make do with what we got. So logs go quite a quite a ways for construction. Uh, I think one log makes about twenty blocks or something crazy, something like that. So I might be wrong, but I don't think I am. Maybe it's ten blocks. I don't know. We'll look. We'll see what we can do. Get this popped and it's starting to get cold. Let's, while we do this, throw this down and warm up. Okay. I don't want to, I don't want our uh, stamina to drop at all. So you can see it's, our temperature's climbing back up right now. It also provides a light source, which is kind of cool. Come on. God, I hope we get a ton from this, enough to make ores. That's really what the focus is right now. We're not going to make cement. We don't need to. But we got to get back and start making the stuff. we got to start spinning up the everything. Come on. Hopefully this will do it. Two minutes. 38. Nice. Okay, that's almost 70-something right there. That's huge. Uh, let's get the... Here, we'll grab grab our heater cooler. Don't, don't leave it like an idiot. Let's go grab this. Just under two minutes. Uh, you know, we'll throw it down too because it looks like we're going to stand here and pop away at this for a bit. But then this will ensure that we can make enough ore, I think, to make everything we need. Time. Time. It's coming down to time here. You can see temperature is dropping. Just over a minute and a half. All right, it's not a minute and a half. Well, it's, it's longer than that. It's an hour and 36 minutes. World game time which is 
Mm, I don't know. It's probably about two minutes or three minutes, I guess. Kind of double it, and that gives you the. Oh come on. Or it seems to be about about 24 hours seems to be or not 24 but 12 hours seems to be uh, 30 minutes or thereabouts. Okay, so let's head back over here. I think we got enough resources. We got a minute and a half to build a build some walls around us. Okay, so we've got this built. Get in there. Oh, right, because it's too heavy. Okay, now get in there. And then what we want right from you is we want a bunch of logs. Give me 30, 40 if you can, please. Oh, hopefully they're faster than that. So what do they take? One wood plank. And I get, oh, uh, how many wood planks? 40. Oh, so I can make 40 blocks. 40. 40 out of one log. Holy crap. Okay. So yeah, see, see what I'm saying? 40 blocks. Okay. Um, let's place this. Let's get this down. Get this down before we freeze. And let's lower it a bit. A little bit more. There we go. And you know what? I'm going to just turn it on to public. I don't want drones coming after us right away without even any weapons or anything that would just, just completely suck. Okay, so what we can do right now is we can get this going and actually, yeah, let's, come on, pull it to there. A minute, we got a minute, got a minute to build a base. <laughs> a little bit rushed, are we rushed? Maybe. Okay, we need, uh, what I got to do is I got to put this down. And I got to stand here. And I got to grab the blocks out of here. Okay, there's not enough. We need more. We need more. Uh, there we go. We get another 10, 10, 30, 40, 50. Yeah. Okay. Let's launch the drone. Nope, that's not it. Launch the drone. And just get my tab tab in for that. So we are, I have no idea what the time is, but let's, nope, get some walls up. Three blocks wide. That's funny. Uh, come on, right there and across. Okay, so we've got basic walls. Nope, come on. Nope. Ugh. Drone is finicky. So now, um, here, let's, I can't grab any of these blocks. What we also need is those blocks are almost done. We're going to need, uh, where is it here? Uh-oh. Uh, one, two. Let's get that going. And it's just about to flip. It's about to flip. Oh, God. I'm scared. We might have to jump inside. And finish this it's minus seven though no armor <laughs> minus seven uh okay we've got those blocks we've got the blocks got the blocks and it's building that okay let's just jump inside really quick really quick and we're gonna get cold real fast we're gonna get cold real fast but let's do this and uh nope come on like that Bring that across over to here to there, and then we want blocks up like this over here, over to there, and now we want the heater cooler for a second. We've got six seconds, uh, we've got that made, and we're just waiting for. The solar panels stay warm and jump in. Mm, don't spawn. Okay. And let's switch to here. Don't spawn near us, please. Let's just put that here. And we'll slowly 
get cold as we wait. We've got 19 blocks on us. What we need to do is we got to wait for this thing. Come on, can we see you? Yes. Sweet. Okay, we've got one built and two built. And let's get these up. Can we just put them up here? Yeah, we're going to go like this. And can we go? Yeah. Come on. You were there. You were there. That's where I want you. And the other one. Oh, the other one won't go. Okay. So what we can do is. Okay, we're not freezing yet. Everything went quiet. Let's. Um, we can put this on the outside. So let's just block this off. And then we can grab the door. <gasps> Did you see that? Holy shit. They spawned right beside us. Grab the door. Come on, close. And then the door. Holy shit. <laughs> ah. uh, not, yeah, that's how I want it. And right there. Ah. And then, uh, oh, we're going to freeze. Can we turn it on? Is it? Is it? Is it? It's, it's turning on. Oh. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. Uh, and, and, do we live? Right at 15. Oh, my God. Did we do this? <laughs> what a, what a. <laughs> yes. Oh man, we pulled that one off with one freaking panel. Oh, okay, we got to put the other one out, and now there's critters out. <laughs> Damn. We have no way. I don't even have a tent. Oh God. What are we gonna do? <sighs> Starve to death? Well, we won't starve to death. We've got actually quite a bit of food. Let's eat one of those. We could we could run around and try and pull them away. Use herbal leaves. <sighs> well, sorry, it's so dark in here. I know it's like hellishly dark. Um. <laughs> okay, uh, you know what? Let's, we need the other one put out. Okay. Let's face this direction then. And we'll just fly out real quick here. Try not attracting them. Oh, they saw me. Did they see my drone? Him. No, doesn't look like it. Oh, crap. Like you can't get much closer than that. Like, like, holy crap. Whew. <laughs> Boy, did I ever get that built in time. That's crazy. Uh, I don't even know which way I'm facing now. Crap. Um, you know what? We'll just do it flat like that. We can probably stick it on the side, right? Let's do that. Right there. If we rotate it, we might be able to put two on. Have little wings. Yeah. Oh. There we go. There we go. It says optimal once it's once it kicks in. Well, um, as you can see, um, it don't like me. Oh no, it's it's. It's attracted by the drone. Yeah, it's okay. So let's pull it over here. Come on, buddy. Hey, no, 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 no. Come on. Come on. Come on, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Come on. Come on. Is it not attracted by the drone? It's not attracted by the drone. Why is the door open? 
Freaking thing didn't close again when I went through it. <laughs> that could have been a catastrophe. Uh, watch that thing climb in <laughs> third person and eat me. That would be death, guaranteed, because that's I have no way of dealing with that. Well, um, huh. <laughs> Hopefully they'll wander away. Well, I gotta log off. <laughs> and uh, until next time, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.